This movie is going to be about my lone wolf collection, or in Swedish, and Samavarian, or in French, uh, Lou Solitaire. Uh, German, I think it's Einstein my wolf, or something like that. So, since my collection started in Sweden, then I will start with that part. This is not all my collection, I think it's like 90, 90 to 95%. I have the rest in Sweden, but here's most of it. So if we start here, here's the Swedish uh, collection. My first book ever, it's uh, Domedags Clifton, book four. Totally love it. That's when I fall in love with the Lone Wolf. The hardest book for me to get in Sweden was definitely this book, book eight. And a friend of my brother, Martin, he had it and made fun of me for a long time. But look, Martin, I got it now. Um, up here, very proud of this one. Bought it from Joe Deaver uh, over eBay, early 2000, from the Magnamon Companion. These two fantastic books, Glory and Greed, by August Hahn. Shout out to you, man. Thanks. Really eager to read the two other books. And The Dragon of Lencia by Richard Ford, also a super great book. Unfortunately, I think we will never get the two remaining book. And this one ends a bit uh, dark, but still very, very good book. Here comes uh, uh, the English version, the collector editor edition, a bit of Mongo's uh, what was that uh, in German? I should know that. And uh, now by uh, uh, Magnum Press. So um, they should be all here. The hardest book for me to get here was definitely book 15 that I got, that I bought from, I forgot the name, Harry Jinder. Pretty active in the forum. So thanks a lot, dude, for that. I owe you. Um, here, I have ordered the, uh, the new book book uh, 31, but, uh, and we're 6 December today, so I expect it any time now. And uh, here's a magazine with the Battle of, I don't know how to pronounce it, Setsa. I since I read The Lone Wolf in Swedish, I pronounce everything a bit Swedish. Uh, this nice dice from uh, Cubicle 7, and these wonderful uh, markers that I bought from uh, Camp Pain coins in Australia, really nice uh, people who work there, very good service, recommend. So that was the first line. Then we go here, what do we have here? We have the legends, and I think I have a few of them in Sweden, but I think it might be complete. So uh, I guess this, I forgot, a beaver edition or something. Then we have the US who put a lot of them, uh, merged a lot of the books. I have no good place, so here's the only German book I have, unless I have more in Sweden, I don't think so. Book 12, Inside Mer Wolf. Uh, some magazine. Uh, I love the 10th anniversary calendar. I know I have more of that one, I have only one here. I know Joe Deaver sent me one for free when I ordered something, so I have a secondary one at least. Then here are all my French books. I know I have more in Sweden as well, so probably I got some doubles uh, when I'm in shops. I never know which one I have, so I gotta document that. But uh, here are the French one, and um, uh, what I wanted to say there, he is called Lou Solitaire. So that's my French collection of Lone Wolf. And uh, here are the legends. Okay, let's move on. I love this section. It's so, it's for role playing. Unfortunately, I have no one to role play with, but there's so much great information in these books and I love to learn more about uh, Magnamond. So I know a scriptum, uh, I can't even pronounce it, but you guys do a great, great job. Everyone who works on this. And August Hahn again. Um, what do we have here? Yeah, double of some. Oh, I love this one, Boken on Magnamund. It's the same as the Magnamund Companion. Wow, I have read that one so, so much. A little story is that um, the Swedish books only go to 12. Well, now 
Ask Fogen is will probably bypass that, but during the 80s. So for me, it only existed 12 books. So when I finished that, I read them over and over. And then after like eight years or so, I discovered in the import bookshop that a book 13 existed. I didn't even know that. That was before internet was big. And that was a great day when I realized that it continued. Uh, what do we have here? We have a German, uh, Bandedons Aufrag. I haven't read that one, I don't know German. Uh, this book is uh, Oskfogen, it's in Swedish. Uh, it's beautiful, really. Oh, it's signed by Jolina, I guess. Nice. Uh, yeah, wonderful book. Love it. Love it, love it. Uh, again from uh, Oskfogen. Uh, great job, guys in Sweden there. Tack så mycket. Jättetråkigt att höra om dig, Tove, att du har cancer. Kämpa på, kämpa på. Tack för allt ni gör. Thank you very much for all the great work. Um, I love the, the skull of Agrash, really great. The two other here is uh, from Megara when I ordered. And I know a lot of people have a problem with the, the guy at Megara, but to me he has always been uh, fair and sent the stuff I ordered, so I, I'm still positive there, but I know I'm sort of alone there. But still, thanks uh, Megara. Um, let's move back. The next section, here's Swedish again, again, it's Ostfogen. My God, I love the cover of these books. So this is book one, Flykt from Mörkret in Swedish. That book one again, but the other one is a special edition. And uh, yeah, those books are wonderful. They are book eight now. They have stopped a bit for a while now. I guess they will retake it when uh, Tove gets better. Um, and here are the English book. Uh, which edition is this? Is it Beaver? I think so. No, Berkeley. <laughs> I should know that. Um, oh, here comes the masterpiece. I bought that from Drew Deaver. Uh, and uh, wow, I love this one. I remember this little ball here. It's description that's a ping pong ball. <laughs> if you want to create this yourself. I tried when I was younger, but I did in paper. It was a catastrophe. Uh, here's the um, screen when you play a role-playing game. Here are some computer. This is for Windows. They're both the same. They have a different etiquette. I think I found it for like one dollar. So I was like, I got it, but I want another one. Fire and Water game. Flight from the Dark game. It's a cassette. And here's the cat. It's not a game. Eclipse of the Kai. It's uh, the book read by uh, Edvard de Sosa. I think you can find that on YouTube when he reads it. Really good. Okay, we go to the next line. Here is, uh, I don't even know where to start. In, for me it was always in Swedish, Silverstjärnan, which means silver star. And in English it's a gray star. And in French, yeah, my French, I know French, but not that good. Astre Or. Or is gold and Astre is probably star. So he's gold star. So Sweden silver star, French gold star and English grey star, but I'm totally fine with the grey star. And for some reason, book three is impossible to find in Swedish, in French. I don't know why they printed that one so little. I, very hard to find. I only got the book three in English here. Book three. Else in Swedish here, I have one, two, four. Two is very easy to find. Then one, two, three, four. Oh, here is the White Warlord, Black Baron, and uh, those books. And here are in French, book one and four, and again, book two. And then Grey Star, again, Megara. I love this book. I think it's um, Gary Shock who have uh, drawn here. Yeah, my God. Yeah, since I started with the book four and fell in love with the Gary Shock's illustration, he's really, I love all the illustration. But his illustration is, wow, something special. Oh, here again, the great information. I love the book about Stormland. Actually, I love them all. But I love to learn more about Magnamund, and these books are really great for that. And again, uh, The Art of Lone Wolf, Gary Shark, very good. And here are the great books from Megara. And a shout out to Martin Charbon. So good. I really hope we get more books here. 
So they are actually the same. Oh, I forgot to mention the free Freeway Warrior. So I have them in English and Swedish. And book three is out. I should order that for Christmas or something. Uh, I actually never read them. Uh, happy to do, I don't know why. A busy life, I guess. Uh, here's another again. I love this one. Got it from Joe Deaver also over eBay. Dawn of the Dragon. You see a bit more around. I find that really cool. These are the coin that you can buy, I think, still from Kubuko 7. If not, you can uh, go to Campaign Coins, uh, Australian side. Uh, Lone Wolf Music from uh, Osk Fogen again. Thanks, guys, in Sweden. These are the legends on the, I think it's a CD, it's pretty old from 2003, possibly a DVD. It's not a boot copy, it's the reel that I bought from uh, Joe Deaver and John Grant. Here are some cards from Osk Fogen, Lone Wolf. So, and again, this is from Megara, that's why I can't uh, say something bad because the stuff I got from that side is fantastic. This is the board game by Gary Shock and the drawings are fantastic. Totally love it. The game is a bit bad balanced, I would say. You can probably modify it. I only played it like two, three times. It's beautiful, but you spend all this calculation to win like 2% who doesn't do a difference. But you can, there are probably alternative rules, so it'd be cool. These are they are the same actually, it's a figure you can build with uh, Lone Wolf, I haven't done that. This is not really Lone Wolf, it's the game by Jude Deaver and uh, Gary Shark and one more. Oh, Ian Page, the author of uh, Restart. Hmm, how I missed that before. The maps, I have three of them, I totally love them. I think if you are signed by Jude Deaver. These are the first maps in Swedish, oh, so far only the first one. Are done. This I found someone who ordered this, I think in Facebook, and he was kind enough to let me copy that. So I did the same order. The plan is I will put the map there. I want to order a second set because I don't want to make a hole in the original. So here are all the maps. Uh, I might be missing the last last one. I bought everyone you can find in Cubicle Seven. I think in Italy you can buy. One more set, so I'll see how I get that one. Uh, here's something special. I hide the text. This is Matador, nothing Lone Wolf. It's Udiver who did the story. And I bought that from him on eBay. Um, I asked um, Project Own if we could put this up, but I don't think that was okay. So that's why I hide the text. <laughs> but. Uh, yeah, it's just a story. It's nothing special, but it's your Deaver, so for me it's worth a lot. So this is the Red Fox uh, version of Lone Wolf. All the 28 books. I know some of these goes pretty expensive on uh, eBay. I think The Hunger of Seanos, uh, maybe the most. Um, for me, it's, I don't care if it's $1 or 10000 I never sell any Lone Wolf. I only buy. Um, and here is not really a lone wolf. This is uh, Gary Schaaf, but I buy everything he do as well because I love his drawing, especially this one, Creatures from the Deep. It looks uh, like it could be from the lone wolf books. Let's see. Yeah, you see the drawing. Fantastic, like always with Gary. Um, the Four Bears, some books, and uh, another book, all Gary Schaaf. Now let's finish with some uh, miniatures. I, I'm really no good at uh, painting, so all paintings are done by others. Let's see what we got here. Uh, well, a lot of stuff. I buy, I don't know, it's a lot of, in Sweden I say Georg, Georg, Glocks in French, but uh, here is uh, Vordak. Here is Vonotar. Here is uh, Banedol, oh, only one Banedol, strange. And here's Kadak. This guy cost me so much. He's real from um, eBay. The other 
three, they have been done later. They are also real, but uh, a lot, lot cheaper. I could have bought uh, a thousand of them probably for the price I bought the other one. Uh, here is the battle at, uh, at Alina Bridge where Prince Pelotar uh, dies. So, oh, we have a Drakkar. And again, I don't think I pronounce it like most people, but uh, it's in my head since I'm little. And here's Prince Pelotar who fight uh, uh, Gorgas. And I have the Gorgas. See if we can zoom in a bit. I have a few of them. Here we have the Nodnik, the one in the Tarnali uh, tunnel, who steal your money but save you from the Hellgast. And here are the guards. Here's a bandit. I'm not sure that's the real bandit. It could be from uh, Talisma. Oh, actually, I have a Talisma, which it's uh, drawn by Gary Shock also. Love that. And combat cars. So here we have him. The person himself, Landar, Silent Wolf, Lone Wolf, and a few of these are probably second order Kai, but this guy at least is Lone Wolf. This is a real big hole in my collection. I know there are a lot of great uh, miniatures of Lone Wolf, so I gotta be better there. Okay, that's that's it. Let's do it quick. Da -da -da, da -da -da. Na na na, na na na, I love it. Okay, thank you for watching.